you could design a complex API and then easily extend its functionality to your customers, your partners, and your fellow developers. Hi, I'm Vince with Axway. Today we're going to show you how easy it is to design your API, bring it into Amplify Central, which helps you take control of how your API is used. Let's give it a try. An API proxy is a wrapper created around an API endpoint. Clients make calls to the proxy, and the calls go through a set of governance rules before the actual API endpoint is called. Before we can register a new API proxy, we need to design our API. There are a variety of tools out there to design your API, but for this demo, we'll use a tool created by one of Axway's partners, Stoplight.io. After logging into our Stoplight account, let's create a new project and name it Musical Instruments. Now we'll create a new file called Musical Instrument. This file will contain the models needed to build our new endpoint. Next, we'll create the model and call it Instrument. This model represents the format of the Musical Instrument object. We can use this editor to specify the attributes we'll need for the model. For this model, we'll need an ID, name, piece, and currency. After saving the model, we'll design the Git endpoint. We'll add a brief summary to describe this endpoint. This endpoint will allow us to fetch all the instruments. Then we'll specify the response object for this endpoint, which will be an array of instruments, and we can use the instrument model we just created. Now we see our full specification file. We'll double check that it's designed correctly and we'll save it to a JSON file. Now let's go back to Amplify Central and add the API we just designed. We'll click Register API and upload the JSON file we just created. After entering the proxy details, we'll click Save and finish creating our API proxy. That's how simple adding your API to Amplify Central can be. Please visit us at platform.axo.com and try it yourself. In our next video, we're going to show you how to secure your API and monetize it.